Welcome to Creations by Karen and today we are going to make a spring floral arrangement bordering into summer, spring, summer, for my Easter craft show that I'm having at the Western Fair District Mark, uh, Egger Prize. Yes. It's in two weeks, you can imagine, and yeah. I've lost a lot of time so we've got to get going. So uh, good morning, good morning everybody, yay. Uh, so we're going to look how cute these are. Now, I got these at Dollar Tree. Can you see them? They're so cute. Little bee unit action happening. I'll give you one. Mm -hmm. You're going to build. You're going to build a craft. I'm going to put mine on a spinner so you guys can see when I'm doing this. You switch sides. Oh, because she forgot my tripod. I forgot my tripod this yes. morning. I have a brain injury. Yes. I'm allowed. You are. All right, so first thing we're going to do, I'm just going to put this up here, is take some of this um, styrofoam that Anthony and I have got my, uh, I out so much. I'm just brain dead. So I just want to measure this. And it's going to go that size. So I'm just going to cut this um, floral moss that I got at Dollar Tree. And I got this at Dollar Tree too. It's a cute bucket. And I saw them all over the place, but see, this was Dollar Tree, so go there. Ooh. Take the saran off of that, measure mine. Floral foam. Floral foam. Doesn't have to be perfect, nothing in life is. Looking for my garbage? Don't hit don't forget to hit it, Anthony. I always do. No, you don't. I guarantee that. Alright, so you just take your uh, your shrink wrap off. Yeah. Put it on here. And then what I like to do is just take a little bit of this remnant that I've got and I'm just going to cut four pieces. There's two for you. Looks very dangerous. And I've got a little bit of hot glue here. Gorilla glue works the best. And all I want to do is affix some Gorilla glue to the bottom of this. Stick it in the bottom of this pot. Just like that. You can do that. I'll show. Some more glue. Maybe. Regardless, she never has awesome stuff like that. More glue, please. A little needy. Don't let it dry. And then you're going to take these pieces and just jam them in the front and back. Just to secure it to the bucket. So well, that's done. Okay, we just put it in the bucket. That's good. Yep, that's lots. Okay. Good morning, Pat. Nice to see everybody. Missed you guys. Really missed you. All right, putting that away so I don't burn myself. So what are these for? Just to... It's oh. just because we're going to put some floral and stuff in there, and I just want to stick them down the front and the back. Just to kind of secure this, so that's what it looks like. You got it? There you go. I like my spinner. I like my spinner. Uh, so I got a little bit of this floral moss. I got it. Uh, I think I did get this at Dollar Tree too. You don't need a whole lot of it, and it goes everywhere. So just be cognizant of that, Anthony. Mm -hmm. Just to open it up. And just put some floral moss in there. Make it pretty. You good? Craft Central is looking a little haggard. Is that? Yeah. So much stuff down there. Because I have my booth at the market, but then I, I also have a big craft space at home, so there's just stuff everywhere when I get crafty. All right. Good morning. Sandy. Hey. All right. So that's what we got so far. Bucket. Got some floral foam in, got some greener. Let's build, shall we? Uh, I got this uh, from Michael's. And uh, it's just greenery. And all I'm going to do is just cut some pieces off because I like to start with greenery first to make a fill. So I'm going to cut this. Uh, I'm just going to cut a few off. And I got my, um, need, oh, what do you call these? 
Help me out. Garden snippers. Sure. Uh, needle, no, it's not needle nose pliers. The heavy duty pliers. Clippers. Yeah, yeah, that's what I'm using. Yeah. And I'm just going to take about five off, and then I'll let you cut five off. It doesn't have to be perfect, people. It's for yourself. I'm, I made these for my craft show. Um, they're very popular. People like it. Aviation snow. Okay. It's a delay. Delay. Thanks, Julie. Yeah. I have a brain injury. I'm allowed to not I'm, remember I'm, anything. I think I've got a one okay. Now. All right. So I'm going to cut six pieces off. This the ends this works. You can go ahead. I will. And I'm just going to start sticking them in this bucket because I like to start with greenery. That's just my rule. You can do whatever you want. And I like this middle part. So I'm just going to stick one here. Just stick it down. You don't have to hot glue this. You can if you like, but I don't. And what goes this way goes the opposite side. And just make sure you put it down where you have your floral foam. I like to stick one in the center. And then I'm going to come this way and the other way. That's tall. Good job. It's getting good, eh? Give me a thumbs up if you've seen an improvement in Anthony's technique. Get a little long here. Oh. Yeah. There you go. So there's my initial filler. Pretty not much to it. But I got other stuff that I'm going to put in. I got this. I like this. Because it goes kind of with your, the deal about, about half. It. So, I'm just going to cut some pieces off. And I like to take kind of just down from the top. And I'm going to take four. The cat's been found. Thank you. Where, whereabouts is she today? Where is she, Dean? She's in, she's in New York. Tell me where you live. Two. I made these last year. Well, similar to this because I didn't have the bucket. Um, yeah. I'm going to take five. And then you can cut five. There you go. I'll take that one. Thank you. Mm -hmm. And I got these at Michael's, and they were on for 60% off. So they were regularly $12.99. Crazy. $12.99 in Canada, but $9.99 in the U.S. With the, um, with the percentage off. 60%. So that's a good deal. All right, so I'm going to go ahead and put some of this filler in. Just going to spin it around so I can do the front first. And I just, I like to turn them and I like to open all of these. And I just put it in the space between where I put the green in. That's just the way I do it. You can do it any way you want. I'll spin it in one sec. I'm leaving a little space at the front because something's going in there. So anywhere you have space, Anthony, just go ahead and put some of this yellow stuff. People are coming into the market, so you'll hear some noise. That's okay. Opens at 10. So vendors like to come in and get their space worked up. Just put this in here. Lots of noise happening. Sorry, guys. All right. So here's where I'm at. Cute, cute. And that's just adding 
some floral. So I've got green in and I've got floral. Let me have a look. Can I look? Yeah, I would just pull that down a little bit. That's all good. All right, so the next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to put, I've got a couple of these black kind of tall bulrushes. No, I don't think they're bulrushes. Right. You want to take the tag off that one? Just it off. Uh, I don't know what it is. Who can tell me what these are? Wait a minute. Should it say on here? Oh, stem black bunny tail. Doesn't look like a bunny tail. You're not going to see this part, so I'm not really worried about it. But I'm just going to cut it off on the, there's a notch here. So I'm just going to cut it off on the first notch. There you go. Do yours and just open it up like this. So it kind of is in a band. And I'm just going to stick it right in the center, right in front of, or the back of that, um, where I put that piece of greenery. And I just open these up. What do you think? Give me a thumbs up if you like it so far. You can tilt these, you can, they're really pliable, so you can do whatever you want. Good, 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 good morning, guys. Cattails. Cattails, Jean, yes, thank you. So then what I got also are two of these picks with uh, these yellow flowers. And I got these at Dollar Tree. Nope, Dollarama. You don't have them in the States. We have them in Canada. And I'm just going to cut it off once again at the first notch that they've made on these. Put that up there. So there's your notch. Can you see it? Can you hang on to that? Perfect. Cut yours. And there's only two on here, so I'm just turning it a little bit. So it kind of goes one way and the other way. And I like to pull these up. And I'm just going to stick it in the very front. Cute! Turn it around. Just stick it in the very front, right in here. So you want to make sure they're going one way and then the other. So pull these up. Tilt that down a little bit, tilt that, and just stick it down. Good? Okay, continuing on. I also got at Michael's these cute little gnome. How cute are these? It says be kind. They were $7.99 a piece, less um, 60%. So there's one for you. I got one. And I'm just going to cut it off hmm, maybe about an inch or two, two inches from the bottom. Then I take this. Don't worry about the tag, I'm not. I'm just going to turn this around and I'm going to stick it in right sort of in the middle of it. So it kind of sticks out. And you can adjust this however you want. Just make sure it's be kind is up front. Look at them. Cute as that. Nice. Nice job. So the last thing I bought are some of this, these uh, daisy picks. And I'm going to need oh, about five. And I just pull this up. And I'm going to use my new or my little cutters here, and I'm going to cut about a few. Here's one for you. You can use your cutters. Oh, 
okay? You do you. You do you, Anthony. I like to pull the greenery up before I cut them. So I think five would work as well. You see a trend? Three, people are coming in the market. They should know by now. Four and five. Okay. Anthony is so quiet. Could get worse. And I'm just gonna stick these sort of right in the bottom around his oh well aware around where my gnome is. Doesn't have to be perfect, nothing in life is. But I think just adds a nice a little contrast to the floral arrangement. And I like things in twos and threes. Yeah. Look at him. Just add some filler. Or stick that one in there. Five. If you want to add more, add more. Now let's spin it around, see how it looks. Okay, he's cute. I might go around and put a little piece of greenery here and there. Just to sort of um, add a little extra. You don't need to do that. I'm just choosing to. Are you happy? You want to maybe put something in the back there? Maybe some of the screen? There. Just to fill it out a little bit. Yeah. Oh. Just going to stick this in here. Just to add a little bit of contrasting color. Here's that. Like it. All right. So then you just kind of adjust it to see if you like it. So your focal point is going to be this gnome. So I really want to make sure that he's front and center and make sure he's straight standing up. What do you say? Give me a thumbs up. He's going to be for sale at my, my spring craft show. Do you think you like that off to the side that far? We'll make some adjustments, Anthony. That looks like a bomb's gone off in a flower shop. <laughs> it's no problem. It's yours, so you can do whatever you want. Looks cute. Yeah. All right, there we are. Love it, cute. I do too, I think it's adorable. Everybody likes, for some reason, yeah. yellow and black. I don't know. All right, I wanna see some serious thumbs up if you're gonna attempt this. Most of the stuff I purchased at Michael's um, all of it 60% off this weekend, so go ahead and get your floral and your gnome. And they have um, um, ladybug gnomes, too. I might make a couple of red ones. It's, yeah. People like red. Red and black. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I like it. Okay, well, that's it. It was great seeing you guys today. I missed you. I missed you all. If you're watching this on YouTube, make sure you like and subscribe so you know every time I come on and do a live, Sometimes it's Anthony, sometimes not. And until then, have a great day, guys. Love you all. Bye, guys. Bye.